I went to the US in 99, after working here for about three years for my business school. And then SA said, I want to be on Wall Street, etc. And when there, it was the absolute peak of the dot-com boom. So, so 99, you land up there and then everything shifted. So I spent my winter break, my summer break, everything in Silicon Valley. So got enamored with this idea of how technology can be applied to everything. And so I tried to break through desperately, but everything came crashing by April 2000. That was the dot-com bust. And so all jobs evaporated. And if you had a visa issue, then there was nothing at all. And so there was this urge, like this pain to like try and get into these sectors when nothing happened. So about five years I spent working there. It was a little directionless, so I moved back. So 2006, I came back to Bombay. I actually interviewed with uh, Rajan's current firm, despite its new name. It's, uh, I think I met some of his colleagues back in 06, 07. So I think most people thought I was fresh off the boat, don't know what the hell is going on in India, why should I hire this guy? And venture was very new, 2006. So I recount the real venture story from 06. There was a little bit before 06, but... And so I reconciled to the fact that no one's going to give me a job and uh, became a banker briefly. And then somehow curiously went to the Times of India group. Why Times of India? I was a media telecom banker. Mm -hmm. And like people thought like I knew a lot of stuff about the industry. What is so a media 